Hello, everyone. I am William from Podcast 17, and with me today is is Benjamin Gring. Did I pronounce your last name right? Yep. <laughs> <laughs> He's our new uh, dedicated reviewer for Podcast 17. Uh, welcome to the team, Ben. Thank you. So, uh, so we sent out uh, an all points bulletin. Uh, actually, Gerardo did our PR guy to try to find some reviewers because the hosts at Podcast 17 aren't it, aren't very good at reviewing video games, and and you responded. So, how did you find out about uh, about us and Podcast 17? Well, I was actually just browsing Reddit for fun. I uh, had no intention on actually looking for a job, but <laughs> I saw it was there, and I thought, eh, what the hell? Why not give it a try? Um, <laughs> I had bought all this recording equipment because I uh, also kind of sell my voice on Voice123 and Voices.com. So I figured while I have it, might as well put some other use to it as well. Cool, yeah. You're, I mean, your your audio recording equipment sounds fantastic. You sound like a very deep, professional voice actor. <laughs> well, I try. <laughs> you can do commercials. Um, I've done a handful, mostly in the Ohio area. Um, Mm -hmm. not much else though oddly enough it's a website I'm not sure why only Ohio people are hiring me but (laughs) it (laughs) just seems to work out that way so you've done a couple of reviews already for us you did uh, Titan Attacks and uh, Containment the Zombie Puzzler yeah I I got a few uh, comments back about that review that was, so what other games are you interested in though? Uh like what if you had to nail it down to one game that that really that you love to play and you play over and over again what would it be? Hmm. My favorite game that I play over and over again. Well, oddly enough at the moment it has been the game Bully Scholarship Edition and I'm not sure yeah. why. I just it's just a really nostalgic game for me. So you like those sandbox type, sandbox type games? Oh yeah, I easily have every one of Rockstar's game on my Steam listing right now. And what's your favorite genre of video game? If you could nail it down to one, uh, just one thing. Probably it would probably be sandbox. Yeah, sandbox games. Um, cool. Survival horror as well. Oh neat, neat. So um, as as you know, Podcast Seventeen is a Valve centric podcast. Uh, you don't necessarily have to be Valve centric because the reviews you're doing. For us, are, are uh, well, they, they lean towards more more towards the indie side, and we have some AAA titles as well. But are you familiar with some of the Valve games? Very familiar with it. First game I ever bought on Steam was the Valve Complete Pack. Yeah. Okay. Cool. So, uh, I mean, you mentioned uh, survival horror. I mean, Left 4 Dead doesn't really fit in that genre. It's like an action horror. Yeah. But uh, have you played Left 4 Dead? I've played Left 4 Dead quite a bit. Um. I haven't played the sequel too much, though I do have it, um, mainly just uh, because when I bought it, I bought it with a bunch of other games as well, and I've been trying to make time for it, but um, for my... And if... Hmm? And sorry, uh, I was just about to say, and if... uh, What what sort of things could you bring to uh, the table for for our reviewing staff? Like, what sort of things do you focus on when you do a review? Um, Do you focus on gameplay? Do you focus on, uh, like, graphics or or what? Um, I find what I find most fascinating with games is storylines. Usually if a game has a poor story, it just turns me off of it completely. Mm -hmm. So, like, like for the difference between, uh, say, Saints Row and Grand Theft Auto where GTA has usually far better storylines, so I tend to gravitate towards that series a little more. Mm-hmm. Whereas opposed to, say, like, uh, Portal 1 and Portal 2, Portal 2's story was far more involved, far more verbose and just filled. So I really enjoyed the sequel far more than the first. Cool. And uh, I guess my last question is, uh, what sort of gaming rig do you have? Do you know your gaming specs or your your hardware specs? I just built it yesterday, actually. This is my newest rig. Oh, wow. Um, It's a Core i7-2700K using an Asus Sabertooth and a GTX 680. Wow, that's a a fancy machine. (laughs) That set (laughs) me back quite a bit. (laughs) So you're ready to go. I should be, though... For the past week, I've been sort of playing Flash games. I <laughs> enough. <laughs> There's nothing wrong with that. I find myself uh, browsing the indie scene more than the AAA scene nowadays as well. Yeah. You get some more interesting things out of that, I think. A lot more unique. Yeah, it's definitely, definitely a lot more unique. <laughs> well, Ben, thank, uh, thanks for replying and welcome to the team. Uh, I look forward to all your reviews, and I'm sure the the subscribers do as well, the listeners, the viewers. 
all the guys out there. So once again, thank you for coming on, and uh, and we hope you have fun here. Well, thanks for having me.